Okay, this is my uh, my load cell setup that I'm going to be using to measure the th static thrust on my uh, Blue Robotics uh, T200 thrusters. Anyway, um, this is uh, made up from components I got from the I guess the robot shop or wherever that place is online that sells a lot of cool stuff, and it's made up of three, well, actually four things. Uh, there's an Arduino Uno back here. There is a, uh, underneath here, you can't really see it, is a second board, which is what they call load cell strain gauge amplifier. So the strain gauge is basically a little Wheatstone bridge. It has four resistors in it. And depending on how much force is applied to it, that bridge will give an output proportional to the, to the force. And then I have a little LCD panel on here uh, that's telling me what the force is. Now, that uh, number moves around a little bit. I'm not sure what that's caused by. It could be just noise in the power supply, but it works pretty well. And the strain gauge is one of these. As you can see, uh, this is a five kilogram st strain gauge. That's what I'm using in my setup. I'll show you in a minute. And, uh, only costs a few bucks. It's actually pretty cool. And this is my 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 system. It's just basically I built a scale, and the strain gauge is underneath there. So as force is applied in this direction, the numbers will change over here on my display panel. So the first thing I'm going to do is put an 8.5 pound weight on there. And it's 8 point, what is it, 8 points, 8.57. And it'll take a little while to simmer down. But that number, that 8,000, um, is relative to pounds. So if you put a decimal point after the right-hand side of the eight, you'll kind of get the idea. I'll take that off. Okay. And then I put on, that was a one gallon of water. Now I'm putting on a half gallon. And it basically weighs a half gallon, 4.2, 4.3 pounds, somewhere in there. So that's how it all works. And, uh, Pretty clever. So now the next step is to get this all hooked up and put on my. Uh, I'll put it. I'm gonna hook it up to one of my thrusters in a tank of water. It's got to be a pretty big tank for several reasons. But anyway, that works. <laughs> 